Hi, everybody. I hope you're all well. Well, it's been really full on these energies as October started. There is an acceleration <clears throat> of these energies coming through. Now, these energies coming through are doing a massive excavation within us, going into the depths of our being and really now clearing out some really old consciousness from across many timelines. So these energies that are coming through in October are creating an acceleration of vibrations that is dismantling a lot of stuff within our, within our core, especially around the energy centers of the base, sacral and solar plexus. Now, the stuff that's being dismantled is around our self-worth, our values, around our survival consciousness, around lack, around feeling disempowered, knowingly and unknowingly, throughout all of our timelines. So it can be a bit intense because the dismantling process covers deep, hidden stuff in our being. So some of these aspects are, con are connected to the shadow aspects of our consciousness. So the energies can be quite strong, can be quite sudden. It's really important that you move into a space of self-care, self-well-being during this time. Going for walks, moving your body will assist in, in this dismantling process. This is happening because the next few months we have an opportunity to have breakthroughs, to move out of an old paradigm, to move out of an old consciousness. What we are experiencing in this quickening process, it's, it's moved to another level, guys. It's moved to another level. So a lot of it is a dismantling of structures of a consciousness in our base, in our sacral and solar plexus. This is also having a direct effect around our head centers, particularly around the third eye, because when there's a dismantling occurring in these energy centers, what, happened, what happens is there is a glitch around the head centers around our third eye because there is going to be a shift in how we see things. There is an expansion that is going around, going to happen around our third eye. And this expansion is connected to us being able to see the bigger picture of ourselves, a realignment to our soul, to our higher self. So that channel where the energy comes through, our crown goes into this new way of seeing, new way of perceiving around the head centers will come through that aspect, that place through our being where our solar plexus, sacral and base has dismantled some very, very old structures. So when those structures come down, there is more room. There is this, this place and space where there is the clearing of that old consciousness around disempowerment, around lack, and around the survival beliefs. Because our survival beliefs are definitely rooted and grounded in not feeling safe, in the energy of fear of stuff, whether physically, energetically, emotionally, of stuff on the external that can harm us, that can block us. When these structures get dismantled, we become more and more in 
the consciousness of empowerment that we are beings of divine light. We know that. We know that mentally. We sense that. We know that. We speak of that. But to experience that, to know it in the depth of our being and ourselves, that is happening. That is yet to happen. So these energies coming through in October, November, December, and they're accelerating, okay? They are in its quickening, in its quickening state. They're coming in and they are pulling and pushing us forward. And it can be very uncomfortable. The reality within you and then externally will feel at times a bit off-center, a bit wobbly because of this dismantling process in your base, sacral and solar plexus. So there also could be moments, quite a few moments, where you feel off-kilter, really off, and just feeling like some of that shadowy stuff is haunting you or is coming up and is making you feel not great. Cleanse your energy field. Ground yourself. Connect into nature. These are powerful allies for you, nature in particular, because it brings you back into the centre of your being. These energies we are in that is coming through intensively at this time will cause a wobbly feeling in your system. Don't go into fear. You are just moving out of an old consciousness really quickly and in all systems. There is a deep, deep excavation going on in those energy centres bringing up and clearing out from many timelines the lives where you have felt disempowerment, where you felt alone, where have you where you felt the grips of what we call the shadow lands. They're coming up and in, in its different formats. What's coming up is the energy. Some of your dreams might be really intense a bit heavy because it has to do with this deep excavation. It is important to find ways to ground yourself, clear your energy, use whatever tools work for you, have healings, use your affirmations, bring in more light, work with essential oils, work with crystals, whatever you resonate with. Because these last few months of 2024 is a massive acceleration and quickening. The energy is coming through to now really do this quickening of the dismantling of these structures in your energy field, but predominantly in the base, the sacral and solar plexus. Because those three areas carry the records, the data, not only from this time, but from many timelines connected to the disempowerment, connected to the disempowerment, the enslavement consciousness, connected to the, the controlling forces, the authoritative forces, not only within us, but externally, because there's that link externally that has kept us in a certain paradigm. Because of the ascension and the evolution that we are in, these structures are being dismantled everywhere, within us, everywhere. So these last few months of 2024, there is a deep, deep excavation in those energy centers. And remember, those energy centers are connected to our programs, our beliefs, our patterns around our empowerment, around our ability to create our lives through our divinity, manifestation, and also any stuff, 
any stories, not only in our being, but in our genetics, in our history, our timeline, around our self-worth, our values, connected to how we see ourselves, okay, those blocks that are around that, they're all being dismantled. Again, this does cause a feeling of wobbliness, of feeling lightheaded, of just feeling off-centre because those structures are being dismantled, are coming down. Use ways, work with ways that work with you to support you in this time. Walking, moving your body does help. Also, I'm going to repeat this. This is also affecting your third eye area because when those, those structures come down, it, it creates this off axis. And so around your third eye, around your mind, you might feel a bit overwhelmed and not able to focus. Using tools that help you, okay, crystals, essential oils, clearing sp sprays, they're really powerful to support you at this time. And also, again, the dreams. The dreams will bring up memories, energies, times already gone in other timelines connected to this disempowerment. The dreams are there to assist you in this dismantling, this, this, this destructuring. Okay, this is the energy that we've entered into, this acceleration, this acceleration to assist us as we are going to have breakthroughs during this time. We're going to have those moments of clarity, those moments where we're feeling strength, where we're feeling a return of an activation back into creativity, into alignment. Stay grounded. Take care of yourself. And I'll speak to you next week. Thank you, guys. Bye.